in OLT Web. Navigate to the deployment page to access the profile list page. Adding a line profile. Create a line profile named line profile 79. The crucial setting is user VLAN, configured as 500. If multiple service flows are needed, you can increase the quantity of TCONT or GIM port. Click confirm, and the success message will be displayed. Adding a service profile. Click add to create a service profile named SRV profile 84. Enable loopback detection for ONU. For the ONU capability planning, choose default adaptive or select the corresponding number of ports. Based on the ONU's real capabilities. IP host is mainly for ONU management. Choose DHCP or static mode. For demonstration, we choose DHCP mode, VLAN 500. Click confirm to generate IP host 0. For port configurations native VLAN. Select unconcern for HGU, and for SFU, choose concern. Configure the native VLAN as 500. Click Confirm. For VLAN rules, configure VLAN mode of the target port as trunk. Other common VLAN modes include transparent, translation, and Q in Q. User VLAN remains 500. Click Confirm and Next. Enable ONU multicast mode, choosing either S. Nooping or proxy. Click Next, and the configuration success message will be displayed. Configure a TR069 profile. Name it TR069 Profile 2. TR069 configuration can be bound to the previously configured IP host or left unbound. Enable TR069. Input the ACS server's IP address and username or password. This configuration needs to match the ACS server. Click Confirm, and the configuration success message will be displayed. Add a WAN profile. Name it WAN Profile 4. In the WAN profile, enable VLAN. Configure VLAN as 500. Choose IPOE or PPPOE mode. Here, we select IPOE. Choose the service type based on specific requirements. For this example, we choose Internet Type. Choose Mode as DHCP. Bind Ports LAN 1, LAN 5, SSID 1, and SSID 5. Click Confirm, and the Configuration Success message will pop up. After completing profile configurations, both policy configurations can be performed. Click Create Policy, and configure VLAN to the target uplink port GE4. Click Edit. Choose VLAN mode as Trunk, configure Tag VLAN as 500. Click Confirm and Next. Name the policy Multi-SRV. Profile 65. Select the four profiles configured earlier. Line Profile. Service Profile, TR069 Profile, and One Profile. Click Next, and the Configuration Success message will be displayed. Apply the configured policy to ports. Apply the policy to POM8. ONUAuth mode can be selected based on specific requirements, SN, SN and Password, Password, LOID, an LOID and password. Here, we choose SN. ONU matching rule is selected as any. Or choose filter rules based on specific needs. This completes a deployment policy effortlessly. When an ONU is bound to pollate, 
the configured policy will be automatically applied.